Hey guys, when you finally receive your JH13 Pro custom earphones, it'll come in a box, most likely with USB shipping labels on it. You then open that box, and then in the box you'll have an Otter box case, which is of this. It'll have your name engraved on it. You also get a manual that I will show to you guys later. And in the in the box you have this velvety pouch. And within the pouch, you'll have your custom earphones attached to the cable, wrapped up neatly in here. And this will be squeezed tight. And it's just like that. You basically unpackage everything. So now, this is the stock cable. I don't use the stock cable. I use uh, the Loom Series cable from Null Audio. As you can see, it's... The wiring for this cable is made out of silver, so it transmits data much better than the, the internal copper wiring in this cable. So this cable cost me $120, and to me, the improvement in sound quality that I get is worth it. So, all right, this is as you can see the um the outer, the outer um the insulation of the cable is more of a whitish color. And then once you get when you once you get past the Y connector of the cable, this is the um the cable management is just like the it's just the same as the stock cable. So now once you get past the Y connector, you get here it's a simple heat shrink, and then this is um knife uh, nylon. I'm not sure if I said it correctly, but it's kind of like a fabric material, cable lining that I very much like and when you're ordering this cable it, they said it's recommended to get this cable because look how basically look how thin this cable is it's kind of fragile but I haven't had any problems with it so far so now when we get down here it then the cable then terminates into a Palex connector which I recommend is it's a very good connector I like the style of it it's, it's um it's shiny and it just has the Palex name brand imprinted on it so now let's go into specific details on what this cable improves it improves the this cable improves the sound stage imaging that's like the most noticeable improvement well not really the most noticeable improvement is the the sense of control that you get it's kind of hard to put in words but it's like the music comes through more effortlessly effortlessly to be more exact now the sound stage um it seems that the sound stage closes in slightly but the imaging is very precise now so I'd rather this change I'd rather a more closed in sound stage slightly with more way more precise imaging than this cable the bass response is a lot more tighter and controlled you hear a lot more detail it's like it's like basically it's like someone just opened a window to the music like the window was a bit foggy between you and the music and with this cable the window has been cleaned so everything's a lot more clearer and um there's no um volume issues or whatever the cable works just like any other cable but it just it just offers increased sound quality this cable was um basically made see cables removable like any other cable it was basically it was basically made for ultimate ears but as you can see JH audio who who was also the founder of Ultimate Ears? He sold the company off to um, Logitech. But anyways, now the the socket connector, they sh but I think Ultimate Ears custom earpieces the socket connectors are recessed, so it goes in. This is to prevent any any of these. You see these dual pins? It pre it prevents that from you know breaking and say you had it on and it bent this way or whatever. With the recessed socket piece of this black part goes in so it's more in lock so now they share the same pin connector so any any cable from JH audio can fit on an ultimate ear okay I mean an ultimate ear earphone and any cable <clears throat> any cable from um from ultimate ears can fit on JH audio not any cable from ultimate ears to be exactly because some of the lower quality ultimate ears earphones do not have removable cables you gotta go up to a probably like the the super fi five or threes and then you go up from there but all custom earphones from ultimate ears 
NJH Audio, they have removable cables because you're think about it, the investment that you put into these wonderful sound and earphones. If the cable gets messed up, you don't want to be without these earphones. So it best that you get is best. It's it was smarter for them to just get a removable cable. You simply just pull the cable out, put a new cable in, and you're good to go. So now let's get to the, the man. Oh, let me just show you guys. I don't use this case when I'm outside because of its size and this latch. Let me give you a quick demonstration on how strong this latch is. First of all, it's very really hard to um to like close. See like Did you hear that? That loud snap just to get this case closed. Now I'm gonna try to open this thing. Do you know how much like basically I don't think you guys can see the like it, it shouldn't take this much force to open and close this latch. It's ridiculously hard to open and close. I was told eventually after a while it won't be so hard to open and close, but seriously, even though that this is too big and clunky to be taken outside, so in fact I use this ultimate Ears metal case. You get this on you get this on the internet from www.ultimateears.com for fifteen dollars and I use that to carry my earpieces when I'm outside and I'm no longer using them. Alright now let's get to the manual here. The manual is just as simple. It teaches you like how to use it and all of that. Care and protection and conservation and all of that. Also tells you at this specific <clears throat> at this specific decibel level how long you can listen to it before you can receive hearing loss. This is very helpful. Teach you how to insert them at first. I didn't know how to insert them correctly, but eventually, in probably two days of inserting them regularly, you'll get the hang of it, and it'll be a lot, a lot more easier. Now, removing them is obviously the opposite of inserting them. Then you have the care and maintenance. Cable management. Detachable cable. Simply you just, you just pull on it. Don't put too much force, don't put any um, diagonal force where you're pulling it to the side just pull vertically up away from the earpiece if you pull it from, if you pull it to the side you can risk bending the pins or even worse you can risk the pins getting stuck in the socket and the actual cable comes out I don't I that's like my worst nightmare and then you have the warranty which lasts for two years from the original shipping date And that's pretty much it. So what you pretty much receive with the earpiece, I mean the, the actual custom earphones. So in the next video, I'm gonna talk more about. Basically, I'm just gonna talk about what I, I think about the sound of these custom earphones. Um, I'll get more into what's the difference between a balanced armature speaker and a dynamic speaker because these are balanced armature speakers. So basically, stay tuned. Thanks for watching.